Resto Mod 101. Hey, welcome back to Resto Mod 101. Today, we're just gonna show you a quick video on how to use this Motion Pro Ignition System Tester. It's part number 08-0122, and let's open it up and see what it does. All right, so what this thing is, is it's to basically test the spark coming from your coil to your spark plug. So what we need to do is find out our spark plug gap. I'm working on an old Ducati Dharma. And let's find engine specifications, petrol feed, lubrication, lubrication, blah, 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 electrical. All right, here we go, spark plug. So the next thing you wanna do is you wanna adjust the tool to the proper spark air gap distance. What that means is the distance between these two points and how far that spark needs to jump. Uh, the way you do that is you loosen this nut right here and that allows you to turn this bolt out. This bolt continues all the way to this point and you want the end of that point to reach one of these marks, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, we have to do ours to six. We're gonna back that out till the point is right at six and then you're gonna lock this nut down. Good, let's take it to the bike. All right, so first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna pull your spark plug cap off. Take your spark plug out. All right, so as you take your spark plug out, you can see that it's just a threaded end. Uh, and if you look at our tester, it has this bulbous end. Bulbous? It's a great word. So you would say, okay, that's not gonna fit. So all you have to do is unscrew this tip. And now your tester is about the same diameter as a spark plug. Now you can take your spark plug wire and go ahead and set the tester into it. And you'll hear it kind of snap into place. There you go. You wanna make sure this end is grounded and you obviously wanna keep it away from where your spark plug hole is because that's filled with fumes and gas. You don't want that spark to ignite that fuel. That would be bad. So I'm gonna tuck this all the way down here on top of the engine. And you wanna make sure that this end down here is uh, touching the block. That way uh, it'll get a good ground. We'll go ahead and turn the bike on. So hopefully now you can see the spark dancing between those two points when I kick the bike. All right, see that spark? Uh, that shows me that I'm giving power to the plug and nice big blue spark, which is exactly what we're looking for. All right, so that tester did exactly what we wanted it to. It tested to see if there was spark going to our spark plug and there is. Uh, it's a great little handy tool. Couple of tips. Make sure you never grab this while you're turning the bike over or kicking the bike over because that spark will jump and get you. And you don't want to obviously use this if you have any open fuel containers or lots of fumes in the area because that spark could ignite those. Uh, and as I mentioned before, don't uh, try to ground this out next to your port where you have your spark plugs going because that's obviously filled with fuel fumes and possibly fuel. Don't want to ignite that either. Anyway, hope that helped and good luck wrenching. Hey, if you learned something or enjoyed the episode, hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe. That way you'll know when our next episodes are going online. Restoma 101.